Hello from Covenant Life Fellowship, where Ken Porter is the pastor. My name is Bev Porter. Welcome to Bev's Lifeline. Today, uh, I'm going to share with you um, about my last two weeks. I don't have a title, but let me just tell you. The last two weeks, I have been on vacation away from my, uh, my normal job. I've been working, thanks to my pastor. It, you know, it's something when you work for um two bosses right i've got my uh, my normal job where i work for um the president ceo and then i've got my um, church job where i work for the pastor amen i'm blessed doubly blessed but over my two weeks where i've been away from my secular job i've learned a couple of things three things a lot of things but i'm gonna boil it down to three things the first thing is I, I had this long list of things I wanted to take care of. I didn't get to most of it, right? But I learned this one thing, it doesn't matter. I'm always gonna have a checklist. It's always gonna be too long and it doesn't matter. So long as I'm taking care of the most important thing. And the most important thing is giving God the glory. Yes, of course, but also taking care of the people that I love the most. That's number one. And that's what I did. Number two is thinking about what's important. My kids would always ask, Mom, Dad, what do you want for Christmas? And we struggle with that question because the truth is we got everything we need. And so it's even more um, obvious now to me because as I get older and wiser, there is nothing that I need. What I, what I, what's most important is life, health, and strength. The fact that I am alive and I have health. And as my mom and dad would say way back when, clothed in my right mind, I got my mental faculties, that's it. The material things that we have, and there are many, don't mean anything. So that was the second lesson. Be grateful for the things in life that are, that moth and dust will not destroy. The third thing is we fight not against flesh and blood. That became real to me on um, these last two weeks, that the things that seemed to be disruptive in my life, that came from, it was like this, like boom, boom. Those things that seemed to be um, attacking me, they were not physical. Those were principalities. Those were things that were coming against me um, to cause me to be distracted from what God would have me to do. And it became real because God has a plan and is using this vessel to fulfill that plan. And so he had to minister to me to say, wait a minute. My daughter, listen, be clear that this that's before you is not a physical thing. It's a spiritual thing. So I've got it myself. And remember, mm -mm, mm -mm, gird up yourself, right? Put on the whole armor of God. So that was my lesson. So I'm so grateful for these two weeks. And now guess what I got to do on Monday? I got to go back to work. But praise God for the job. I love my job. I love being able to help others. I work for an organization that I'm really thankful for. Uh, Inroads, I-N-R-O-A-D-S, you ought to look it up. Uh, it's a great organization. So, those are my three things. One, I don't care about the checklist. Two, um, the most important things in life are not physical. Three, we fight not against flesh and blood, but against principalities. Ah, great lessons. I'm grateful for my two weeks. Thank you. This is ministry. Like it and share it. I love you infinity. Bye for now.